Hello and welcome to another episode. I have a new skin and I have updated uh, my texture pack. Uh, and to see if you're curious about those changes, I made a video in the description. But about the skin, uh, I wanted to make something that was a bit more less cute, I guess. And more similar to what I would wear in real life because I love my tank tops so this is what we have and uh, a ponytail because my ponytails are nice and uh, yes and we have under skin customization we have a mask of our logo can't really see the ears. If we do this, you can see that there are ears on top. Uh, ideally, they would be pointing upwards, of course, so I will make a picture of that. And now, let's move on to today's episode. We have some updates. The roof there, I will put in. And uh, I love the sea have been put in on the inside so this is of course all oh hello there oh i've got an armor let's not forget the armor that's fine okay and then here all of this have a ceiling room here too oh and uh, this room and this room as well as here, the uh, this uh, the greenhouse here doesn't have a roof yet. or ceiling. Sorry. If you go up here, you get to the next floor. We will have a corridor or hall that goes around here, and uh, yeah, there will be like a big room in the center, which would be like the master bedroom. Of the windows here, like I've said before, and we also need to build up that tower down there because we still haven't done that. So, the tower have been added. We don't have any spikes yet because I'm out of a nether brick fence. Also, I noticed that we don't have any windows here, so better fix that on the inside. This floor looks like this, it's just a very small room. We will of course make nicer lighting later. I also made this back thing. It was supposed to be a tower but it can't be seen from the outside. But I did, did make it uh, exactly the same as the one over here on the inside. And same goes for the floor below. down here so that are that's our towers oh and the glass here too I went ahead and I added some toys to our base here so first we have this one so this is a serotic is the beat tape thing that simply moves blocks in uh, a circle. So you can step like this across like that, like this. But since they are serrated, they move them like really quick, which makes the drift really funny. I've always liked on how it looks when you serrated uh, blocks like this. Because it looks like this is not moving, but it these are just preparing out of it. So I put that to the floor. And I did this.
the end. So now we have a roller coaster that goes through our uh, little base here. It goes through the machinery. You can see it here. Put in uh, logs to make it be look supported and stuff. It's a fun little thing I thought. And finally, <laughs> uh, we have another new thing that is over here. And it is this thing here. So, above the sugarcane, we have four platforms. And they're very simple. It's just uh, lit up uh, dirt. So things can't spawn here because the light levels are too high and the grass will not spread. So this is like um, a grass farm. We fill this with dirt, put in one grass block and eventually it will all be grass. And we have four floors. So if we ever need grass, we can get it here. Oh, and I, I did this. I moved the, these furnaces here out from the wall. So that I can fit uh, double chests underneath, or chests in general, and uh, also hoppers above, so that uh, if I want to smelt, let's say, like more than one stack, I can just put the uh, skeleton. Okay, and uh, that's it. We are here in our little village, Satya, and I just added something to it uh, butts archery butts an archery um, shooting field because in England at some point during the middle ages it was required by law that all men on the Sunday I believe had to go to their butts and practice archery so almost every village during that time in England had a bat and and therefore that's what we have added and it's over there sun is going down so we have this here we have some bows and arrows and some stalls and uh, yeah long shooting field here this this is not as long as it would be in real life this could be up to like 200 meters long and there's no way that I'm making a 200 meter long shooting field for this tiny village that would look very odd so we have this, this is, I haven't measured it, but I would guess it's about 50 blocks to the longest one over there. Then we have this one that is a bit closer. So uh, this is a butt. It is a little dirt mound. There's a little ditch around it where they have gotten the dirt to build the mound. And uh, then it would be flat on top and that's where they would build the... Uh, um, like the, the target uh, thing, put the targets on top of that flat, uh, they were circular and flat on top. And the size vary from like 3 meters up to like 8 meters or something like that in diameter and the height varies from like half a meter up to like 3 meters. So we have one that is 1 meter high and one that is 2 meters high. And uh, yes, this one also have a bit of a thing behind it. To catch arrows or whatever, I guess if you miss. And uh, yeah, that's that. You can see that the inside walls of the third floor of the palace have been put in, but the facade have not. So that's what we're going to do now. Something else that had been completed. Is this tree? This is a very large tree. And uh, the ceiling in here is almost complete as well. It's 
So I replaced the statue in the center here with this big tree. I thought that was a better idea. And if we go up the stairs, you can see the ceiling here have been put in all along there. We have this little balcony here. As you can see, most of the ceiling here is complete. I just need to do some a bit more up there to cover that up. We have this big room here that does not have a ceiling yet. And then uh, we have this side. So, we need to figure out how to do this here. This one right here should be an arch. So let's see if we do... Hmm, how? Okay. Let's start like this. We hit the roof. No, we won't. Okay, good. Very good. Okay. There we go. That's the center of this thing. Then we need to extend this. So these need to go basically all the way to the top. Let's see if we can do that. get it here. Thank you. Okay. That is that one. We need this one to be the same way. So, yes. I'm just gonna make all these Four pillars all the way to the Okay. That is that. Now we need to put in the walls. Okay, so I want a lot of windows, and I'm thinking that we should have. Maybe we should have it like this. That would give us two windows there, two windows there. Yes, that sounds good. We will have one window right here. And this... Goodbye. It's going to go up. Have it like that. Okay. Now we're going to need to do something here because we don't want things to be able to spawn. So we'll start by putting these like that. That's that would be like the window sills. And we'll have slabs out there that should a nice pattern on the outside as well as preventing things from spawning there. This whole thing is spawn proof yet. Okay. That is good. Then let's see. If we build this all the way up, how tall do we want the windows to That's a very good question. I'm thinking that maybe there. Yeah. Okay. I 
I have an idea as well about how to do the outside here, so let's see if we can get out. Okay. So if we then have these there, then we can have upside down stairs between them. Or even better, we could have it there. Yes, that would be nice. So I'm gonna do that on this part. That does look pretty nice, I think. I changed my mind and this is what we have now. So instead of having three uh, pillars and four holes, we have four pillars and three holes. But the middle one is of course where the inside wall is, so we can't have a window there. So now we have two windows per side. And it just looks more interesting to have the four pillars instead of the three. It looks much better to me. So there we go. The exterior of the palace have been completed. Okay, let's check the inside. Here we have the entrance hall. I've put up a lot of paintings in the palace because I feel like that's fitting. And this would be the library. Over here we have a hall. I don't know what to do with it. We have this room here and this room here. Then we go up the stairs. Here we have a little bit of a corridor with another room, this room here, and this room. Then we have this large room here, and our greenhouse that have a finished ceiling now. I can't really see it, but it's up there. Then we can go up another floor. And we have this balcony over the top of the greenhouse. A little bit of a hall back here. And then we have the bedroom. I built this uh, bed. It's pretty nice. And this window here, you can see it's moved out one block, so you can really get a good view of the town. And next, we will do all the furniture. But that is the, the palace, this, uh, the building completed. We only need to do the like I said, the furniture. And then it's done.